YouTube, what it do, man? Y'all already know who I am, man, man, grind hard. Checking in again with another video. And today, back at y'all again with some updates on this new patch that we just got, all right? So look, we coming live and direct from Mike Wang Baluba's Twitter, all right? Shout out my boy Jay Easy for letting me know, because I was, oh, hey, look, check this out. I was just over there on Xbox, you know what I mean? Got that new build, I'm getting it in, all right? If you uh, ain't haven't added me yet, it's man, man, grind hard with an X instead of an I. I'm making my build right now. I'll show y'all my build uh, video later, later today, probably today or tomorrow, something like that. But we over there getting it in and whatnot. So look, check it out. Mike Wayne hit us with some updates on this new patch or whatnot, right? Now he said that the new, the official patch notes will be coming later on, but I'm going to just go by what he hasn't released so far, all right? So check it out. Hey, hold on. Let me let me go back real quick, show y'all something. I ain't following this nigga. They don't fuck with me. I ain't hitting y'all with a follow, but I'm sure I'm going to make some videos about this shit. But check it out. Patch 1.02. You can shoot driving floaters from farther away from the hoop, similar to 2K20. If you want the pull-ups, you are getting pre-patched, center the left stick before shooting, before hitting the shot button pro stick. The rest of the official patch notes should be coming soon. Pretty much, I was trying this the other day because I couldn't de I couldn't determine whether the floaters was based off of your close shot or your layup. You feel me? And I couldn't do a float unless I was right up under the damn goal. And I mean that wouldn't affect it. So I'm glad they patched it. And then another thing he said, he said, let's see, nerf to phase is not in this patch, but will be coming in patch 1.03, which is still in uh in active development. Ankle breakers would, fuck, man, while well, I'm reading like, I'm reading like flight out this motherfucker. Uh, ankle breakers should work better today, but the full fix for them uh, will also come in patch 1.0.3. Uh, okay, ankle breakers, I'm bit this still don't work but he said they should be you know kind of active or one oh shit the official patch notes right here all right so look check it out hold on before i get to that he also said um here we go patch 1.02 park moves off off the dribble or off the fuck bro i'm really fucking this up bro let me slow down all right i'm I, i've been fucking with flight for a little bit you know what i mean and flight got me really done this shit out but look park moves off the drive or now mount to our stick uh our stick holes like the cross behind the back escapes when standing. Try flicking and releasing right stick for regular cross behind the back. If you're accident accidentally getting park moves, L2, LT will give you hard stops like you used to. I don't know none of that shit, man, bro. You feel me? I wouldn't ever do no park moves. But let's look at these official, the official tissue patch notes. All right, let's see what's on here. You know what I mean? Let's see. Pro stick aiming for first boot. Yeah, we saw that. So now, you know, I... You know how I talked about that today when I was up, uploading the first video? I was saying, like, they could they should give us, like, a little update or whatnot. They didn't give us, like, an update when you first signed in or whatnot, but it, it, it would let you it let you choose whether you want to use the shot stick aiming or just the regular how we've been uh, square or X, depending on what system you're on, all right? So that's what that is. Uh, fix several hangs that could happen when entering the X in a various game mode during the same session or when idling out of certain areas. Andrew Wiggins now appears with updated face and hair to more accurately represent his appearance. What's one of y'all niggas out here staring at Andrew Wiggins' face, uh, recognizing that he ain't have face or hair, bro? Y'all niggas, y'all niggas in fucking instant replay going crazy. Y'all niggas trip. All right, but look, gameplay enable the ability to use pro stick shot aiming with the shot meter setting turned off. Okay, cool. Idle shot aiming point now determined by how quickly. Or slowly, the pro stick is initially deflected when starting the shot. And a slow flick will move the idle aim point to the left, while the fast flick will move the idle point to the right, giving players more consistency with the pro stick shooting. So basically, you pull that bitch down fast, it's going to go one way. You pull the right stick down slow, it's going to go another way. I don't know how good or bad that would be, but we will find out when we get to playing the game. You know what I mean? Change any up to use uh, competitive slider settings, more skill based. Ooh, stage. Stage then got stage called a nerf. Okay, stage with the little nerf nerf. Okay, when the shot feedback is set, uh, setting is set to off, players and opponents will no longer see excellent release green light animation. Huh, wait, wait, wait. When shot feedback setting is set to off, players and opponents will no longer see excellent release. We won't see greens when niggas got the shot feedback off. Damn. I don't know how I feel about that, but hey, I don't I turn the shit off no way. I right, fix unwanted fadeaway shots that were playing after immediately shooting out of certain dribble moves. 
Improved standing dunk reliability when using the pro stick. Cool, cool, cool. Disable the double ten indicator in the effort to clean up the screen. You are based on community feedback. Uh, who was complaining about double ten indicators when if you're not a sharp, you can't shoot? I don't know, but yeah, they fixed that. I added the ability to shoot driving floater from farther away from the basket. We already talked about that. Uh, park, we moved, talked about that. Clean up the animation pops in the dribble move system. So I guess that's the little, the little speed boost and glitchy glitch. You know, when you do a crossover, you like literally glide across the floor a few steps before you even actually move, and it's unguardable. I'm glad they fixed that shit. Uh, fix ball physics bugs when shot time will set the real player percentage. Yeah, because real player percentage, um, it bugged me out the other day. When I was trying some, you know, I was trying some different little shit in my career, it really bugged my play out. Tone down the effectiveness to lead to a basket pass feature to prevent exploits. All right, my career. You know what I'm saying? Now, check it out. We're going we gonna to read my career. I'm not reading my team. You feel me? I'm not reading my league. We don't give a damn, all right? Fix pro m 3v3 hang that was being reported by the community. Fix the hang that some users reported when entering X in the cage. Y'all bitches shouldn't be at the cage. No way, bro. Why? 2K. Please let this be the last year we got cages. We need the parks uh, packed. We don't need motherfuckers in the cages um, running from us trying to get it real. And you know what I mean? Cages got to go. We, we, we didn't have enough of cages, all right? Address the case where some users reported loss of control of their my player during gameplay. <laughs> yeah, y'all be, be going through it, bro. I, there's a lot of this shit. I ain't even know what happened, bro. I fixed the issue in the mock court where the player was unable to finish some in the game with certain NBA players as AI. Fixed the hang that could happen at the start of a three-on-three game in my court. Fixed the issue where fan growth in part games was not properly uh, accumulating. Addressed the issue where custom shoes were sometimes not showing up properly on other players in the beach. Mm. Never noticed that. Uh, fixed the hang that some users reported when transitioning between beach instances. Uh, user will not receive the correct scene after winning the college championship. Hey, and based on what we came here for, that's pretty much all we got for y'all. You feel me? Uh, for this patch, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get back to grind this my career, but real fast before I let y'all go, let me touch on something right quick. All right, a lot of people were saying uh, some dumbass shit about like why why people they don't have sh uh, sharp bills, mad they can't shoot. First of all, bro, let's uh, I'm gonna give you a prime example. Nobody would ever consider Jordan or Kobe a sharp shooter, but they would literally bust your ass from the mid range, bro. I'm, bro, a slashing playmaker should be able to hit a wide open mid range. And the reason why I say that is my fucking mid range is 80 fucking three, bro. You know what I'm saying? How many of y'all went to school? If you get an 83, you know what that mean? That's fucking great, bro. <laughs> you, you fuck around and get a 75, my nigga. You did great. You know what I mean? And D, F is only when it's like, bro, you fucked up. D, for, you know, nigga like me. Y'all might not, but D, it's, it's, it ain't, I ain't fail, bitch. But, you know, but we anything 75 and up, that shit is excellent, bro. So, with just a little bit of skill from 75 to 80, bro, you should be able to hit a fucking standing mid-range. We not, I'm not asking to go goddamn 9 for 9 for deep half-court 3 three ball bro we complaining about not being able to hit mid ranges with fucking 12 shooting badges and i i fucking rating it like 80 something bro like that, that that's that's the shit that we're talking about i'm not saying i want to shoot like a sharp i'm not saying them but i feel like i should be able to hit a wide open mid range because y'all give us that all the time because y'all just stand in the fucking paint but look it's a whole nother discussion i ain't even here to have that with y'all you know what i'm saying i'm on the eggs by the ground of my mom player i'm gonna patch notes for uh 1.0.2 Make sure you leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. My man, Ground Hard, checking up out of here.